Hi CryptoCancer Queens, welcome to my channel. My name is Natalie. In today's episode, I will show you why I took this buy position on BTC around 18,150. The market is right now trying to break above this little resistance that we have after we've had a retest of the Fibonacci levels. When it comes to Ethereum, we have the exact same thing. The market is right now inside Fibonacci levels where we can have a continuation up to 1,450. But if we break one support level, that can take us back down to 1,360. 74 a potential retest to 1450 because if we are zooming out ethereum is right now retesting a weekly trend line and the fibonacci level so we are in a crucial level and a zone where the market is expected to drop don't forget i'm no financial advisor you need to look up everything yourself first but please continue looking at this video and i'll show you the trade that i took on btc and also where we can expect the market on both ethereum and btc to reverse down from before we're getting into the charts and the ta on btc and on ethereum i want to share my favorite platform which i'm trading cryptocurrencies on which is bybit this is a leverage trading platform really good when it comes to holding your positions for a longer time with low fees and zero fees when it comes to spot pairs at the moment so if you are someone that wants to trade cryptocurrencies bybit is definitely the platform for you if you are someone that wants to trade forex index cryptocurrencies together then you can also use prime xpt and you can see that i am at this moment inside three positions on nasdaq right now that i took from yesterday's new york ses session live stream and i took my take uh, my entry around eleven thousand two hundred and fifty, and at the moment i'm in profit but this is a great platform for anyone wants that wants to trade multiple currencies and you can receive a bonus up to seven thousand dollars right now also if you're looking at the description down below my video when it comes to b2c and the ta we're going to go through it right now and what the market it is doing on b2c is that we are reaching the 50 and 61.8 percent and you can already see how the market has been retesting the 50 percent around 18,453. if we're just highlighting this level and just drag it back you can clearly see how the market is also retesting if in this case a previous support that we did break and what is the most basic things that we learn is that a previous support just might turn out to a new resistance and combining that with the Fibonacci between 18,453 and the 61.8% at 19,140. If we're zooming in on the four hourly chart, you can clearly see how the market does have a rally up to the upside. And most likely, the market will only give us a small pullback before we are continuing to higher targets. So, usually, what I am doing at that time is that I'll drag two Fibonacci levels because the market just might need to retest a lower one. So, I will start off with the 15 minutes chart and i will drag a fibonacci from the last higher low with the higher high which gives us fibonacci level 17,840 and 17,943 another thing that i also want to do is that i will use the support level that i have around 17,926 which gives us the fibonacci levels around 18,098 and also 18,150 and you can cl clearly see how the market is already retesting this level another thing that we can do is that we're highlighting this, the resistance trend line going even down to the five minutes chart that the market is about to break this level at this moment and this can actually be where we see the market have the momentum and the continuation to the higher targets because what we're looking at right now is a small pullback and this can be the rally and based on this fibonacci that we're looking at take profit one is eighteen thousand four hundred and eighty take profit three eighteen thousand 1717 and take profit 3 18915 and take profit 4 I would use at 19170 so based on that the market is right now looking that we are going to continue from these targets we can expect the market to have the continuation to the higher time frames levels and this is also where we then could probably see the market consolidate before the market reverse the trend. So expect the consolidation market between 18,450 and 19,200 because this is the higher time frames Fibonacci levels where another reverse can break down from. This is how it looks for me right now when I've been taking the trade on BTC is that I do expect the market to reach 19,200 and I will have my stop loss below the box here at the 50 and 61% 
Fibonacci level. If we're looking at Ethereum, we're starting off with the weekly chart and you can see how this weekly trend line is right now combined. If we go down to the lower time frames, weekly trend line combined with the Fibonacci between 1,375 and 1,450. The market can definitely try, try to break above 1,450 because that is usually what the market is doing. But what we need to have in mind is around these levels, we can expect the market to have another drop. So we just might see some fake from 1450 and then a continuation to the lower targets if we're doing the same thing that we did on btc is that we can use the support and uh, we can use the fibonacci from the lowest point to the highest point which means that if the market continues to drop we can reach 1380 and potentially 1370 for a potential retest a continuation to the 61.8 percent around 1450 if we're looking at the five minute chart what we can do is that we're using the previous support zone combined with the high and we are right now inside the Fibonacci levels between 1397 and 1402 and you can clearly see how the market is actually using this previous support this previous resistance sorry as a support level at 1395 so as long as the market is above this level this could be the beginning for the market to continue to higher targets but if we see that the market is breaking below the support at 1,395, this would most likely be the beginning and the market will show us and have a break retest. And then that can be the drop to the 50 and 61.8% that we took from the one hourly chart. So around these levels is very important now to see, but usually what the market is doing after we've had this huge breakout candle is that we're actually only giving a small pullback and then have a continuation to the level. In this case, 1,450. This is the last Fibonacci level the market needs to retest before we see a probability and high probability a chance for the market to then reverse down again thank you everyone for looking at this video together with me don't forget to subscribe to the channel hit the notification so you know when i am live next time when i want to do have my daily updates it's going to be exciting to see if this will be where the market on ethereum and on btc is reversing so please drop a comment below this video and tell me guys what you see at this moment on these pairs until we see each other next time have a great day everyone yeah.